Now that the Democrat insurance policy against Trump went down in flames with the Mueller report, they are moving back to plan B. Getting Trump's tax returns. They think Trump's taxes hold the key to impeaching him. They failed in 2016, and many times since. And Trump's refusal makes Democrats think they're onto something. Why? Because their House of Cards came crashing down on them with Mick Mulvaney's latest announcement on Fox News. Acting White House Chief of Staff Mick Mulvaney said Sunday that congressional Democrats will not get access to President Trump's tax returns and have no right to demand them. Never. Nor should they. That's an issue that was already litigated during the election. Mulvaney's response comes just days after Democrat Richard Neal asked the IRS commissioner to turn over six years of Trump's personal and business tax returns. No dice, says Mulvaney. I in fact, Mulvaney says what Democrats are asking is not only unnecessary, but highly unethical and illegal. They know the terms under law by which the IRS can give them the documents, but political hit job is not one of those reasons. That's exactly what this is, a political hit job. Obstruction and impeachment seem to be the only two goals the Democrats have had since Trump won in 2016. They don't care about proving anything, they just want Trump gone by any means necessary. But Mulvaney has made it abundantly clear that Democrats have no right to demand Trump's tax returns, and they also can't demand the IRS release them. Even with an act of Congress. And we have Mick Mulvaney for standing up for Trump, the law, and the American people.